So into the battle matches we go now with the 2020 Olympics over in Tokyo. Of course, a win here will guarantee you at least a silver medal over in the Olympics. But of course, you've got to get past the semi-finals first. We'll take a look at that and more next. That's right, folks. Back once again with another prediction video today. Look forward to the 2020 Olympics men's semi final. That's right. We've got a prediction video coming at you, and we'll get to that in just one second. If you're new, where you been, boys? Smash your subscribe and get your banger today. All things Olympics related, Blackburn Rovers related, well, football related. We're getting it all here. Oh, no more Ruski. That's right, of course. Uh, yes, we're now left with just four nations competing for three medals. One of these guys will go home with absolutely nothing. We'll talk about that in a minute. Of course, big big shout to the VIPs. They are the patrons. Thank you for your continued support. And of course, I look forward to seniors. Uh, as we get closer to the start of domestic season, boys, we'll get to all of that in a minute, of course. Uh, but right here, right now, we're going to go into the deep end, which is, of course, recapping the uh, quarterfinal matches and bringing you bang up to date with the prediction, prediction league. So here, so here we go then. Jump in the deep end. Let's have a look, take a look back at, of course, the quarterfinal matches and, of course, bring you bang up to date with the prediction league. So here we go. Uh, of course, recap some of those games. Uh, and they're coming at you thick and fast right here, right now. Of course, Japan, the hosts, they squeeze past the New Zealand uh, in the end on penalties that's right I actually remember the 2 nil win myself it was actually a nil-nil draw uh, Japan squeezing through of course on the penalty kicks 4-2 I think it was uh, let me know if I'm right or wrong on that I can't really remember as for the next round of matches of course South Korea uh, was my tip to go through past uh, Mexico 2-1 but unfortunately got spanked 6-3 uh, nine goal through they go in favour of Mexico and of course they will go through to the semi-finals that's right so of course joining them will be Spain ousted of course Ivory Coast in the quarterfinals 2-0 uh, was my pick 7 goal thriller there uh, as Spain go through and Ivory Coast go home. And also joining them, uh, we Boisou. That's right. 3 1 win was my pick over Egypt. Uh, but just the 1 0 uh, in the end to get themselves through, also through uh, to the semi final. So, of course, not too shabby there. I got myself 3 out of 4. Not too bad. Let's take a look at how you guys got on then, shall we? Of course, it's the lead wolf of this week. Uh, a lot, whole bunch of you's got them all right. Uh, and of course, uh, th uh, four, four, 4 of you has got 3 out of 4 uh, joining me as well. But what's that does the overall lead? Well, here we go. Hopefully, I've corrected it all up to look nice and clean. Of course, we have a three-way tie at the moment. Iman Hussain, LJ Cow, of course, Hanman Sale uh, have all got 17 points. Hans West not too far away either with 16. Gaming Charlie in 15. And a chasing pack as well. Uh, but of course, it all changed. We've still got one, two, uh, maybe four points on the offering. So realistically, anybody from first all the way down to ninth can still win, uh, of course, and we'll uh, hopefully have a winner very, very soon. But that's the situation we've got right here, right now. Let's go forward and take a look at those semi-finals. Now, before we do that, here is a recap of the uh, URL. If you want to jump in and with the predictions, of course, if you join in at a stage, you could get still get a couple of points and maybe just win that uh, that respective uh, match day. So uh, get in the box. It's Tokyo SF. Uh, of course, cut the in front of that. So if you want to be a, a savvy little but a soccer, you could go do the QR code just like that. Uh, but anyway, let's get the deep in there. Shall we take a little look at, of course, the semi final? So here we go. Kick it all off with Japan. A bit uh, Spain, of course. These games take place on Tuesday, August the 3rd. That's right. Early door kickoff, 7 a.m. my time. I have no idea what time it is, wherever you're watching because, of course, it will be completely different. Of course, uh, Japan managed by uh, Hamije Moriasu. Of course, Spain managed by uh, Jose Luis de la Fuente. These two nations have played at under-23 Olympic level twice since 2012. It's been one win for Japan, uh, uh, one draw between the two sides. So no wins for Spain uh, heading into this. Uh, Japan came is 92% form, of course, picking up five wins in the past six games. Meanwhile, Spain came is winning two of the past five games. Of course, just two wins. Um, on their journey so far here in the uh, in the Olympic Games. Of course, there's a recap, of course, how they all started. Start with Japan, of course. They opened up the Canby that was the one win over against South Africa. Beat Mexico 2-1. I followed that with a 4-0 win over France. Of course, uh, sidestep New Zealand 4-2 uh, to get themselves through to the semi-final. As for Spain, uh, they drew with Egypt 0-0. Of course, now only beating Australia and drawing with uh, Argentina as well. Uh, they also came by uh, Ivory Coast with a bit of a barnstormer. 5-2 after extra time. Uh, I must uh, elaborate on that. Uh, of course, heading into this. Quick look at the bookies odds for this one then, shall we? We've got Japan 5-2. Uh, they're actually 21-20. Uh, is your Spain the island favourites? 12-5 is your draw. That is, of course, uh, to uh, to win this game. Uh, as for the title odds or the gold medal odds, Spain are 6-4 to win it. Uh, Japan are 6-1 right here, right now. I'm going to go with 2-1 win, unfortunately, for Spain. I think Japan will go through. Of course, they'll go to the bronze medal match. And they'll probably fancy their chances, of course. Uh, take it on. Uh, maybe Mexico on Brazil, whoever they may be in that uh, in that uh, bronze medal match. But anyway, so far for me, Spain 
on paper, they've not been that good. They've not been that good, to be honest with you. But the, the, the players are there. They've got the personnel that, that, that they'll be able to succeed at this level. So they should ultimately make the final and, of course, compete uh, heavily for that um, uh, for that gold medal match. So, of course, uh, Max up against Boazou. That's right. Of course, that takes place on Tuesday, August 3rd as well. Earlier kick at 4 a.m. Now, these two nations have played each other just the once uh, at uh, Olympic level uh, since 2012. And it was a 2-1 win going in favour of Mexico. That is correct. Uh, of course, Mexico coming to 67% form of course as for Brazil they're coming to 92% form as well that 2-1 win was back in 2012 in Brazil uh, of course coming into this though uh, Mexico of course uh, beat France uh, 4-1 they did uh, lose to Japan 2-1 and sidestepped South Africa 2-0 uh, 3-0 in the end and of course came through with that 9 goal for, uh, up against uh, uh, South Korea uh, just in the quarterfinals as for Brazil of course they beat Germany 4-2 drew, drew with Ivory Coast of course they beat uh, Saudi Arabia and of course narrowly beat Egypt uh, to get themselves through as well to this stage of course Rickelson got some 5 goals uh, to his name so far. Uh, as for Bra uh, Mexico, they've got a whole bunch of goals in them, uh, which is a, a nice little statistic to have. As for the bookies, odds, it's 23 to 10. Is your Mexico 5 to 2? Is your draw 21 to 20? Is your Brazil? They are your favourites. So it's 20 to 20 to 21 on. So they are they are actually uh, strong favourites on this. So bookies, odds to go the distance. 11 8 is your Brazil. They are the favourites for the gold medal. Mexico are fourth. Uh, they are the massive underdogs. 4 uh, 6 to 1 to go the distance on this. For me, I'm going to go with Brazil 3 0 in the end. I think their quality will rise above it and of course we'll put them through into that uh, gold medal match and in my eyes it'll be a Spain Brazil uh, final let me know your thoughts of course as we look forward to that uh, do you think there can be anybody else uh, in that final do you think Japan could upset the Africa or maybe even Mexico as well let me know your thoughts and opinions as we look forward to that final of course make sure to check out Cass's very own prediction but until then give the video a thumbs up smash your thumbs up smash your subscribe check out the links down below on Twitter Twitch Facebook and of course Patreon as well but until then I'll see you soon for the next one whenever that may be